Merry Christmas everybody also this is my hundredth video so I guess it's a Christmas special and a hundred video special oh my god so I'm doing my first ever Photoshop video so let's not waste time and let's get right right it right let's go So I want to talk about this piece and originally it was supposed to be Mr. Klaus and I did have a video before this and I scrapped that because I didn't like the piece that much and with this um, again like Mr. Klaus sort of type style but that never made it because it was too hard so I want to try something simple which is something that I've actually never done before where there is no action and there's very little work and it actually came out a lot nicer than I thought it did so yeah it enjoy Well, it was originally supposed to be a deer, like a half man, half deer kind of thing. But then I thought, I think the elf kind of style would really fit. Because it's like, you can make up your own story as to like, what really is about it. And I think, you know, it's, it doesn't have to be complicated, I guess. Shadows are the most important thing to do in a photoshop because it allows things to feel grounded and natural in, well, the photo. But I decided to make the background black, uh, well, nighttime, so I guess the shadow would have to be very dark. So don't get too attached to the morning. Don't be alarmed as to why there's suddenly a deer or an, a reindeer, but um, I wanted to have, like I said, I brought back the idea of like him being half a deer. So here's an antler, and I decided to make it glow. I, it looks cool. Shut up. Originally, I only wanted the moonlight as a source of light thing, but I thought that uh, if the antlers were to glow, it would actually look better. And it actually went a lot better than I expected. And if I had went with this original idea, I don't think it would have popped out as like the piece that I have now.
there is a tutorial on the internet on how to make the antlers grow which is the same method that i use uh, by using gaussian blur multiple times and adding multiple radius onto it blah blah blah, blah all that stuff check out the youtube right now put it on the screen all right that's all The stars are brightly shining It is the night of our dear Savior's birth Long lay the world in sin and never pining Till He appeared and the soul Lighting has never been my strong suit, so this piece actually did kind of train me. I think like every Photoshop where you have to learn about lighting, but I feel like this piece was. It feels like it. It's a great start for me to actually put in and learn a lot about lighting and how it works and all that stuff. And I've taken lessons, or well, not lessons, but I learned from Benny Production and I've watched Phase Runner. And mostly just like Benny production on his highlight videos and face runners for his neon style kind of lighting. And you can see with the antlers taking form of face runner and the highlights coming from Benny production and all that stuff. And I think it really did kind of help train me and you can see as I keep going back and forth on like the lightings and the shadows. And this is this piece really did kind of push my lighting skills and it helped train it so i think there was a, a good one so yeah the snow on the face was probably the hardest one i ever done because i didn't know how to make it look natural and i was playing around with the brushes to see which one would fit but I think for the first time, it came out really nice. The rain was a lot easier, okay? But this one was like really the hardest one because I didn't know what looked natural and it was really hard. I, I don't have snow from where I'm from, so I'm just guessing what looks good. So don't come, don't at me, bro.
and that was the video for my Christmas special tell me what I should improve and all that stuff uh, in the comments down below subscribe if you enjoy the video I would love to have you around like it if you really love the piece Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year bye guys